this is TC Pro M. I'll show you how to operate this unit. So that's the power button in here. Switch on it. You can remove the lid. So make sure there's nothing in it. So it will come up with E3 error once you remove the lid. So that's normal. Don't worry about that. Now I'm going to add ingredients. So imagine you have some ingredients and you want to scale them. Push the wait button. It will show up 355. I think that's the rate of uh, the lid. So reset it. Press the wait button again. And then you can add ingredients. Now, for example, this one is it says uh, 500 grams. That's bitter dates. So I'm going to put that in here. So it gets us 515. So once you add that, before you add the, ne add the next ingredient, press that button. Then it will be zero then if you want to add something more we say something now this is 375 grams of peanuts you can put it in there so it's 385 press the wait button once you added everything you can close the lid So after that, that will fluctuate, but you set that to zero and that's 345 grams is the weight of the lid. And then you have to reset it. So to reset the scale, you need to press and hold the power on off switch. Then everything will be reset. Then you can select the time, temperature or whatever you want the settings and then start the button. So I can't use it as it is. So I'm going to remove this. Otherwise I'll be in trouble. And, uh, Maybe I'll add a little bit of water. So I'm going to add a little bit of water without just uh, always better to put that to the minimum level up there. That's the minimum level. Then close the lid. Now, always you can, if you are can reset it to reset press and hold anyway it's already reset so that means you hear a beep sound when it's reset uh, now you can set if you want to do a blending simply you have to just press the speed and do it like that and start so it will go on speed one if you want to change the speed go like that so make sure to close that lid lid insert and uh, stop it and if you want to reset, now it's blink, press and hold uh, this button. And if you want to blend that for, we'll say, 5 seconds or 10 seconds, at some speed, you can press the time. Now 5 seconds, 10 seconds, so I would say I put that to 5 seconds. Speed, so it's for 5 seconds, speed 2, and then start. It will blend for 5 seconds and it will stop automatically. Like that so now this one still blinks so after each and every program you have to press and hold this button to reset it then it will reset everything and for heating the same you can set the time temperature to whatever and then uh, speed to whatever and then start then, uh, I need more time Sorry, more temp more temperature because it won't uh, put it to 45 for time uh, three minutes. Speed two. You can see the temperature will go up. up. it's heating and after two two minutes and whatever that it will go off and once it come to that temperature it will stay there it will go up a little bit and then comes down and it will be stable after that it will be stable so and if you want to stop that pause it and hold that again to reset mm, what else i think that's it and if you want to just do the heating you can just press the heat button so the temperature is set temperature is 44 
sorry not 44 actually uh, yeah you can set it to whatever the temperature and then press the heat button but usually you don't have to use that in order to reset as always press and hold that button i think that's it so that one for, that one for pulse that one for just heating that one for uh, making door so if you make press that button it automatically works at speed 4 and that's it it stops and runs stops runs that's a, that's a auto pro automated program to reset so hope this is clear